Radioactive wastewater from the Fukushima nuclear facility started to be pumped into the ocean. The Fukushima nuclear plant's operator has begun discharging radioactive wastewater into the ocean. On Thursday, Tokyo Electric Power Company Holdings broadcast live from a control room at the plant when a staff member turned on a saltwater pump to start the contentious project, which is anticipated to run for decades. Japanese fishing organizations have rejected the initiative because they are concerned about possible damage to their seafood. Additionally, groups in South Korea and China have expressed worry. The water must be released, however, according to the Japanese government and plant managers, to create a place for the facility's decommissioning and to avoid unintentional leaks. According to the government, after treatment and dilution, wastewater will be far less harmful to the environment and safer than required by international standards. The UN nuclear watchdog approved the measure last month. The publication starts more than 12 years after the nuclear meltdowns in March 2011 that were brought on by a massive earthquake and tsunami. The first batch of the treated, diluted water is transferred from a mixing pool by the active pump to a secondary pool, where it is subsequently released into the ocean via an underwater tunnel. On Thursday, 460 tons will be transferred in a batch to the mixing pool for the actual discharge. After treatment, some of the water is collected and used as cooling water. The remainder is held in about 1,000 tanks, which are now 98% full of their 1.37 million ton capacity. The new facilities required for the decommissioning procedure must be built on top of those tanks, which cover a large portion of the plant complex, according to authorities. The fisheries, tourism, and economy of Fukushima are concerned about the leak since they are still recuperating from the tragedy 12 years ago. Due in part to a fall in the fishing population, the region's current fish catches are only around one-fifth of what they were before to the crisis. According to authorities, China has strengthened its radiation inspections of Japanese goods from Fukushima and nine other regions, blocking exports at customs for weeks. This morning, the Prime Minister of South Korea, Han duk Su, requested Japan to provide information on its wastewater outflow from the plant for the next 30 years responsibly and openly. Meanwhile, China's Nuclear Safety Administration on Thursday called the Japanese government extremely selfish and irresponsible in forcibly launching the discharge, putting its own selfish interests above the well-being of all mankind. <laughs>